A ship has various machinery and systems which needs constant monitoring and periodic overhauling. This heavy machinery needs to be opened up for checks and maintenance. For this, a vessel contains cranes and lifting gear. However, there are many areas where small cranes cannot be fitted, like the engine room, bow thruster room, steering gear room, etc. This is where manual hoists are pretty handy and are used extensively. They come in many guises and are used to successfully and safely move heavy items. If set up and used correctly, a chain hoist is one of the easiest and most efficient ways of lifting a load. But have you ever wondered how a small chain is able to lift thousands of kilos of weight with such ease? The first procedure is to select the right chain block for the task, which depends on the load being lifted. For instance, if we need to raise the cylinder head of the auxiliary generator engine, which is around 400 kilos, a half-ton chain block would be ideal. Using a chain block of higher value is always wise, as a stuck part will draw more load than expected. The correct cylinder shifting tool, wire sling and eye bolt should be used. Now comes the functioning of the chain block, which enables us to lift tons of load manually with ease. A standard chain block consists of a lifting chain, a hand chain and a base hook. The chain block is connected to the load via the base hook. Lifting a heavy load is possible by using multiple larger and smaller gears in the chain hoist mechanism, which increases the mechanical force by at least a dozen times. When the hand chain is pulled, it turns the cog and axle, which goes through the lifting mechanism. The cog turns the drive shaft and the gears turn the load chain sprocket. This rotates the load chain that is looped over the load chain sprocket and lifts a load. Inside the lifting mechanism are multiple gears. Larger gears move slower than smaller gears but create more force. This is why chain hoist lifts the load very slowly. A locking mechanism locks the load and avoid downward movement due to gravitational force when no pulling force is being applied. Hence, when a load is lifted and not pulled, it will keep hanging in the air. What machinery and parts have you lifted with the chain block on ships? Let us know in the comments. And for more such information, follow Marine Insight.